Well, the city is projected to decline in value to the U.S. dollar by 8.6 percent plus or minus 1.50 percent by the end of 2020. This is according to research from Data Bank. Now, this is lower than some 13 percent recorded in 2019. More detail in the following report. By Data Bank revealed, on account of support from the Bank of Ghana, partly offset by fiscal risks to the outlook, the 2020 forecast for interbank dollar CD rate will hover around 6 CDs, 5 pesos, plus or minus 10 pesos. The CD is projected to decline in value to the US dollar by 8.6 percent, plus or minus 1.5 percent by the end of 2020. They are optimistic that the Bank of Ghana's bi-weekly forex forward auctions will deepen forward trading and limit spot market pressures. The Bank of Ghana published its forex forward auction calendar for 2020, signaling its plan to inject a cumulative size of $715 million into the forex forward market this year. Government also plans an early issuance of a $3 billion euro bond to bolster the central bank's capacity to execute its foreign exchange forward auctions. Besides the forward market interventions, it also expects intermittent forex sales on the spot market to limit short-term volatility. The CD suffered significant losses in 2019 as investors priced in the risk of a lax post-IMF policy environment following a raft of unexpected fiscal and monetary policy outcomes. Key among the unexpected policy developments in 2019 were the 100 basis points cut in the monetary policy rate to 16% in January 2019, as well as the February 2019 Interbank Forex Market Directive, which increased the minimum tenor for foreign exchange swaps between non-resident and resident counterparties to three months. The subsequent publications of weaker fiscal and public debt data further dented investor confidence in the policy outlook and intensified the outflow of foreign capital, weighing down the city's devaluation. The city presently trades at 5 cities 51 pesos on the interbank market, but trades for 5 cities 81 pesos at the Forex Bureau. The city ended 2019 at 13% depreciation to the U.S. dollar.